Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are recreating, I'm in Gaji's stunning, maze animation. Let's do it. Here, I already added my project files to the timeline. If you want to download these project files, you have to become a member of this channel. First we will extend all these layers duration to 10 seconds. Let's reduce cursor size. You can also use move along path effect to animate the cursor, but it's not worked perfectly. Let me show you how it's work. Add vector drawing tool and draw a path as I shown in the video. Extend this layer duration, and drag it under the cursor layer. Now hide this layer visibility, we don't need it. Now select cursor layer, and apply move along path effect, you can find this effect in move and transform section. At the first frame of this layer, add progress keyframe. Now move 8 seconds forward. Here, increase progress value up to 100%. Smooth keyframe curves. Adjust orientation value to minus 90 degrees. Now we have this kind of animation guys. As you can see guys, it's not working perfectly, if you think it's working perfectly, you can use it, but I am not going to apply this effect, I will do it manually. First I will create rotation animation to the cursor. Add rotation keyframe here. Move 10 frames forward, and rotate as shown. Now smooth keyframe curves as shown. I am going to use this curves for all keyframes. Now here, add position keyframe. Move 10 frames forward, and move cursor as I shown. Now smooth keyframe curves as shown. Now here, add rotation keyframe. Move 5 frames forward and change cursor direction as shown. From this keyframe, move 15 frames forward and change cursor position as shown. Now we have to do the same thing, until the cursor reach last line. I am going to speed up this process guys.
Let's see the preview. It's better than previous one. Now we will create line breaking animation. From this keyframe, move two frames forward and add a position keyframe. Now move 10 frames forward and change cursor position as shown. Always smooth keyframe curves. From this keyframe, move 2 frames forward and add a position keyframe. Now move 10 frames forward and change cursor position as shown. Now here, add rotation keyframe. Move 5 frames forward and rotate the cursor as shown. Now from this position keyframe move 15 frames forward and change cursor position as shown. Now it's time to break the line. At this point, add vector drawing tool, and draw a shape as I shown in the video. Now duplicate this shape layer, and adjust it. Let's rename this layers. Now duplicate maze layer two times. Hide these two layers. Now duplicate two shape layers. Hide copied layers. Now select these two layers, and tap on masking icon. Now we have this single piece guys. Unhide it. Now select these two layers, and tap on masking icon. Now unhide this layers. Now group these two layers. Unhide it. Now select these two layers and tap on exclusion icon. Now select this layer. Add position and rotation keyframes to this layer. Also add to this layer. Now move 20 frames forward and change position and rotation. Let me adjust little bit more.
let's add text. I have created fade in animation to the text. Apply glow effect to the cursor layer. Now select all layers, except background layer and group them. Now I will create direction signs animation. Now add camera, and animate your scene.
that's it for now guys thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe